All right, people. Welcome back. More Binding of Isaac. So, uh, last run was okay. I was I was a little bit too slow. I'm, you know, you're too slow, Sonic style. Anyway, we unlocked the cathedral and we did what we wanted to do. I think who we play as. We played as uh, Maggie and we beat Satan. So that's really what I wanted to do. So we're gonna start going up to the cathedral and we are going to play as my man Judas here. Judas is arguably the strongest character in the game. You know, they you know they did they do polls on Binding of Isaac and they're like, uh, all right, dead bird. I guess I'm a little bit of Eve. Like, I'm, I, like that's not even good part of Eve. Like, can I get the good part of Eve? Hello. Uh, you know, they do questionnaires and surveys on the Binding of Isaac forums, and they ask, hey, what's your favorite character? He thinks the best character. And, God, everybody and their mother was saying, Judas, Judas, Judas. And you know why? It's because of that little space bar item right there, that book that right there that I have in my hands. That thing is so good. All right, so not only, not only is it a damage upgrade, but it also guarantees a deal with the devil, except for on the first floor. And other floors, but floors that you naturally get to deal with the devil on, that's where you'll get the the deal with the devil with the Book of Belial, guaranteed. So even if you take red heart damage, bam, it's, it's like having goat's head, except with damage, and it's your space for item. Now well, the only thing that's risky with Judas is that you know he starts off with low health, which is fine, which is fine, you know. You know I don't care about health. I, I'm trading away my health. You know, you give me you give me the right deal with the devil, and I will take it. Hello. So, uh, Isaac updated for me, which is good. So, uh, it updated to version 1.041, I think that's it is? Yeah, I think so, which is good because that, uh, oh, okay, see, I'll go ahead and take HP upgrade. Uh, that was definitely an update. And do I even need to go to that room? Hello? No, I'm not gonna go to that room. There's no, there's no reason for me to go to that room. You know, besides consumables, but I'm sitting okay right now. And now I have too much health. What is that? Inner eye? Inner eye? You trolling me, game? You're trolling me. You're like, hey, hey, we'll give you inner eye, but you gotta have the ability to fly. Like, I love it. I love it. I hope I get the ability to fly in my deal with the devil. I'll come back and grab that bitch. Like, tell me, don't tell me I won't, game. Alright, that was bad. <laughs> that was bad. Good thing I have a guaranteed deal with the devil on this floor. Because the Book of Belial. And I guess. Eve's bird can do some... I don't know. Eve's bird sucks. Like, it's AI bad. Like, you know, there's a... It's a fly. I forgot what the name of it is. But there's a fly. When you get hurt, it summons and attacks. That is good. Like, it has a great AI. It does its job. It gets... It pays the bills. Like, hello? That's that's what I want. I also want some bombs and some keys. Like... And then now you're saying like, ah, you should have went to that big room. You could have got a bomb or a key. Like, nah, it wasn't worth it. It wasn't worth it. I probably was gonna, it was gonna do more harm than good. Thank you for this bomb. I'm gonna go ahead and slap that bomb down right here. Go ahead, blow up that tinted rock. Give me my bomb back and a spirit heart. Nice. All right, I say the boss is definitely this way. Like that, uh, that's easy to tell. <laughs> so, starting on this floor and beyond, we are gonna get some deals with devils. I don't want to take any. Fine, we'll go deal with the, with the I mean, deals with the angels. That's fine. They gotta be something good, though. They can't just be, you know, something stupid. Alright, I'm getting tired of popping the poops. Should get an arcade next. I mean, yeah, I should get an arcade next floor since I got five cents. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead pop up into my item room real quick. If you love me, you'll give me the ability to fly. Sure, luck fits okay. More consumable drops. I can still get bad pills, can I? I think so. I think so. So... I, I, I don't know how luck fit works completely. I would love the ability to fly. Like, if I fought this boss and they gave me freaking like, Spirit of the Night, I would fucking grab that, fucking come back here and grab that inner eye, fucking triple shot this bitch. Hello, what am I talking about? Oh, I need to show you the seed. Alright. It's EXK89L8J. I always do it on the second floor in case, you know, I'm sucking butt, but... Oh, and Dingle. I love Dingle. And by love Dingle, I mean I hate Dingle. Alright, little shits. I saw you. I saw you, little shit. I hate the three-prong shot. But I'm getting used to how to fight Dingle. How to fight Dingle. Should be a book. It doesn't need to be a book. Stay horizontal with Dingle. Never, never stand vertical. Never stand vertical. 
shots are harder to dodge and it's just dingles harder to deal with when the shots are vertical. I got that dare guaranteed deal with the devil. Kill that bitch. I'm killing these hoes out here. Yep. Ooh, cut of nine tails. Damage up. Sure. Shot speed's fine too. Alright, well, this doesn't count as a deal with the devil, so I guess I'll be taking some deals with the angel then. Until I pass up a deal with the angel, or the deal with the angel doesn't give me anything good, then I could pass it up. Wow. Terrible. Can I get some spirit hearts? I got got some uh, freaking partners to fight with me, but hello? That's not what I needed. At all. I, I, I wanted some spirit hearts. Didn't get the ability to fly. <laughs> no inner eye. That's fine. Judas is strong enough. Judas don't need no inner eye. It's like a tears downgrade. I don't need that in my life. Yeah, I'll trade a bomb for this chest. Got a bomb and a key. I mean, that's 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 a great exchange, you know. I pretty much got a key, <laughs> and a key means item room. So that is nice. Let's see, there you go. Damn, that that spider crashed right into that fly. He's like, I got this, homie. I'm like, all right. So, uh, unlike in the original Binding of Isaac game, shot speed's not actually that bad in this game. Yeah. Not bad. Uh, no. Shot speed used to be terrible. It used to be like, oh my god, a shot speed up, like kill me, kill me now. No, <laughs> but now, now it's, it's actually pretty chill. It's not bad. So what I get in my first item room? My first item room, I got bird. Is that bird. What did I get in my second item room? I don't even remember. Did I just pick it up and put it down? Oh, what did I get? What did I get? Oh, luck foot. Damn, that's sad. I don't even remember what the fuck I got. Hello? <laughs> Damn. I'm surrounded. Look at these flies. Just wreck them real quick. I'm probably going to be getting a deal with the angel on this floor. Spider butt. That item is shitty. Especially in comparison to Book of Belial. Which is probably one of the most powerful spacebar items in the entire game. You could argue, you know, D6 and this and, you know, Krampus's head. There are some good, some good space for items. And there's some shitty ones, too, so I really can't be like, oh, all of them are good, you know. There's some shitty ones. Like Necronomicon. <laughs> oh, he blew up the, the mushroom and it poisoned him. I was about to say, I thought these guys couldn't get hit, you know, poisoned by their own attack. Like, no, he got poisoned by the mushroom. Like, oh, shit. Shroom is tedious. <laughs> My damage is okay, but it's not like, you know, blowing the doors off or anything. And I suffer from too good to use syndrome when it comes to Book of Belial. You know, I'd rather just go ahead and save it. Save it for the boss. I, I should be okay on the floor. The boss definitely use it then. You can go ahead and sit down and die. There we go. Alright, definitely think the boss is over here. Yep. Two little teratomas, bonding some spiders. Spawned two spiders. I thought I only spawned one per. Nope. That's fine. We'll go ahead and fight the boss. The hollow. Oh, it's pretty easy. Watch me take like a sh crap ton of damage. Yep. <laughs> they locked me and they blocked me, and you saw that. <laughs> Probably be getting the deal with the under here. I got a guaranteed something. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. No. Guaranteed deal with the devil. So even if I didn't take one, it's still the devil. Mushroom. It's getting out. I mean, it's a nice, uh, all stats up. Krampus. 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 <laughs> He saw that Krampus was slowly just walking towards me. He's like, mmm, look at that body. <laughs> like, calm down, Krampus, hello? Just one more shot. Yeah. Krampus' head? No. Mumpa Cole, I'll take it. If it was Krampus' head, I was going to have to say no, but Mumpa Cole, I'll take it. That, that's nice. That's a nice little damage up. We have not gone to our item room on this floor, have we? No, we have not. So we're going to go ahead and do that. I like the layup. I like it up. 
seven minutes, so we just got done with the third floor. We might be able to make Boss Gauntlet a thing. It's just my damage isn't, you know, blowing the doors off anything, so that might be tedious and dangerous if I don't get something really good. So, wait, did we go to our item room? I don't remember what we got in our item room if we did. Uh, against Super Wrath, I think that's what his name is. Super Wrath. Some bombs. Maybe we did go out item room and I just don't remember what it was. Oh yeah, it was Spider Bite. See? Sometimes sometimes these islands are just so damn shitty that I just can't for the love of me remember. Look at me, I got three HP with Judas. Like, hello, I'm I got these guaranteed deals with the devil and trading them away worth shit. Like, come on. Like, come on, I I I, I wanna go ahead and trade away some of this health. Give me brimstone. Brimstone. I would love a brimstone run today. You know, we're going to the cathedral today. You know, gonna go ahead and kick some Isaac butt. So I'm chill with that. That was risky. So, my call's pretty good. My tears get stronger as they travel. More damage. Okay, sit down. I got that lump of coal, you don't even know. I got that range that pays the bills. Sit down. Ooh, card, what is it? Stars. Sure, I'll use it, take me out of room. Uh, Rainbow baby, that's not what I need at all. And I was going the complete opposite way of the item room. I don't need no Rainbow baby. My item rooms have not been that good. Not at all. Range up. All right. Well, that works well with uh, lump of coal. You know what? Yeah, I'll use a bomb here. Grab that spirit heart. I'll try to bomb for a spirit heart, and I'll try to bomb for a couple cents too. Make the shop worthwhile. There we go. A rainbow baby. That's not what I need. There's an arcade. I'll go ahead and gamble a little bit. Especially there's a demon judgment. Like. Hell yeah, Demon Judgment, but I doubt it. Yeah, just Blood Bank. Go ahead and earn some more money. There we go. Nothing wrong with trading away your health. There's another heart over here. Yeah, yeah, might as well pick these up too. Trade them away too. Huh? I don't need them. I don't need health. I need damage. And you play Judas calling Mr. Damage. Get these fat stacks. And by fat stacks, I mean a couple cents, not even equal to a dollar. <laughs> All right, still looking for. Oh, the boss trap room. So, I uh, had and went and used my health. Nah, that's not worth it. If you were give me like an item pedestal, I would have probably done it, but. Not that. It's not worth it. Not a big fan of this room at all. <laughs> I need to aim. There we go. There we go. Got them curve shots. Take that bomb. I'm gonna say, if these guys don't turn into the bonies, they're actually pretty tame. But if they do turn into the bonies, then I'm not about that life, because the bonies are actually pretty difficult. It's a pretty big, you know, curve between those two. Greed. Well, at least I get more money. Oh, I'm glad I'm fighting Greed now, so I don't have to deal with them later. Steam sale, sure. So, steam sale means I'm spending less on the items that I want, and that means that I can donate more. Still gotta go ahead and donate. Unlock more things in the shop. I was just talking about you guys. I was just talking about you guys. Hello? Now, when I got Lump of Coal, shot speed's not nice, but you know what? I really can't complain now, can I? I mean, it was a damage up. Like, well, I, wouldn't, I would never pass up a damage up just because of a tier's, I mean, shot speed upgrade. Never, ever, ever in my life. Ever. Damage. Alright, so I'm playing as Mr. Damage right now. Judas, call him Mr. Damage. 
So, <laughs> don't fuck around with Judas. I said, arguably the strongest character in the game. Mega Fatty, alright, time to test my damage, so. We're gonna be here for a while, people. Because Mega Fatty's got that health. Trying to keep my distance from him. I want him to go ahead and do that attack. That up and down attack. There you go. So I can get out of the fucking way. <laughs> and move to the other side of the room. There you go. He's done. Wow. I, all right. I get it. I said that the shot speed up is fine. But come on. Like, come on. I'll do it for the terror card. Empress. All right. Yeah. Hell yeah. I'll trade one of my health for arguably the best baby in the game. Hell yeah. Love run, baby. We're doing fine in time. Like I said, I'm not sure how strong this run is to make, you know, boss gauntlet. So, you know what? No, it's not worth it. That's a far, 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 far walk. There'll be another arcade on the next floor. You just play the blood bank there. Hopefully make the shop worthwhile. We're sitting okay right now. So, in infected baby, if you don't know, uh, uh, spawns flies. Sp flies, uh, scale with my damage. My damage. Not the baby's damage. My damage. So, you know, if you want to go ahead and just keep shooting, spinning out them flies, more power to you. I said, I'm just not sure how, how you, how well I'm going to do it in boss god, but do I have to do it for Judas? I think I do. I hate these fuckers. I hate them, and their long-ass necks being able to reach me. I can't even get out of the fucking way. Health-wise, I am not doing so well. Let's say, let's say, infested baby, you want to go ahead and just handle this? Just go ahead and spit out flies for me? Say flies, you want to go ahead and handle that for me? Thank you. Uh, definitely run into the struggles right now. And the struggles is I have no way of regenerating my health. Come on! Wasting my damn time. Monster 2. Go ahead and pop that book of Belial. Oh, this is this monster. Isn't this the monster that doesn't jump? Well, I mean, do the big jump. I think it is. I don't think he does his, uh, his big jump, he, which is like his best attack, so. Die. Uh, it's a tears and a shot speed up again. God, my tears are gonna be fast. No, 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 no. <laughs> I see you, I see you, game. You're like, hey, you, I mean, you traded one for infested, baby. What about a ghost, baby? Like, no, no, don't even try to fucking put ghost baby on the same pedestal as infested, baby. Like, you're, you're, you're on crap, game. Hell no. Infested Baby is arguably one of the best babies in the game, while fucking, uh, fucking Ghost Baby is, like, barely above fucking Brother Bobby, like, as one of the shittiest babies. You know, it might be in the same pool, it might be in the same tier. Sure, I'll pick up Nun's Habit. I'll go ahead and donate down to 15 cents. Actually, I can donate down to 7 cents, actually. I'm only looking for one more item. It should be a shop upgrade now. Yep, store upgrade three. Nice. So I'll donate all the way down to seven cents. Still need to go to our uh, item room. That still needs to be done. What else? Nothing really. Deal with the devils haven't been, you know, blow the fucking doors off the house good. It's been kind of shitty, so. Alright, there you go. It's nice and clogged. So, there we go. Go ahead and buy a key and uh, make my last shop worthwhile. Let's look for my item room. My item room would be great right now. Where is my item room? Not over here. 
Okay, don't do it. Don't do that. Infested baby. Don't spawn them flies and make them blow up where I'm standing. Um, item room's not over here. Okay, we're probably not gonna make the... The, uh, uh... Boss gunlight. Like, nor do I really feel like doing it right now. Like, not at all. Nope, this isn't the right way either. Damn it. I seriously doubt I'm interested in this. Nope. <laughs> you would have to give me an item on a pedestal to make me do that right now. Damn it. Damn it, what the fuck is my item room? <laughs> like, hello? Like, I must be missing something. I'm about to get trapped. Nope, nope, I got out. Oh, I lost my last spirit heart, too. Nope. Is it this way? There it is. Finally. Ew, hate this. Hey, flies, go ahead and pop them in the back of the head. I should really use some of these bombs on these skulls. Let me start doing that. Headless baby. Alright. All the babies on this floor. This is just baby floor. I can simply just walk out, so. And they'll just despawn, so. That's not even what I'm worried about. What's this tarot card? High Priestess. I'd rather have Empress. I don't trust High Priestess. I don't trust myself with High Priestess. The better explanation for that. Wow, alright. Uh Let's just move on. There goes that spirit heart. That's annoying. Say so anybody wanna give me a black heart? Say like, damn. I'll take a hero front card. Damn. These skulls are just like, you know what? Nah, fuck you, Daniel. Like, alright. Alright, that's how it's gonna be, sure. Still, this run is not looking, you know, OP, not even remotely. Still have to fight these goddamn Zombros. I was not even paying attention there. I was busy looking at the creep thing, where the zombie's gonna go see if I could create a child of creep. The world, on Empress. You know what? I'll go ahead and pop the world. See everything. Alright. A library over there or something? Treasure room? No, that's not worth it. Holding key? Alright. Wasn't really in a big need for keys. We could probably make the boss gauntlet. The thing is, though, do I want to do it? Yeah. Because, of course, I got I have to use my Book of the Lyle on Mom so I can get that deal with the devil. Quarter. Uh, I don't need any more money. Like, item runes have just been just hilariously bad in this fucking, uh, this fucking run. But Judas still holding it down because he's fucking Judas. Uh, excuse me. I can't even get out. I'm stuck. I'd say I was expecting to take some damage there. Like, I hate this room. This room is a pain in the dick. No, my damage isn't no blowing the doors off of the freaking house, so I uh, said so this is the room of the pin of the deck. I came over here for the shop. Uh I don't know what converter is gonna do for me. There's a battery, but I can't get out, you know. I guess I'll go ahead and buy this. Pills haven't been the best, so Converter, I don't even know you know what? I'm gonna pick it up and put it back down. Just so I could say that I bought it. Yeah, so I could say I have it, because I don't even like that item. So, there you go. I went to myself, never attack gurglings when they run. Because you start bouncing them all off the walls and shit. Let's go ahead and fight mom. Which mom is it? Regular mom? God damn it. Spawn the enemies right on me. Hate fighting mom. Hate 
hate fighting moms so much. One of the most annoying bosses for me. Because I'm so used to looking at Isaac. Now I gotta look like all around. Alright. Skish. I mean, is there really any point? I mean, we'll pick it up. Uh, uh, mm, uh, yeah, I'll do it. How do I rotate with my cards? I don't even know how to rotate with my cards. Now I'm more Babylon. Shears is good. No, I gotta get Sad Onion. So, I'm for Babylon. That's nice. But, this is gonna be a while, guys. Because my damage, like I said, is still not like, oh my god, yes, you know. So, we're gonna be here for a while. It may even die in here, actually. Sad Onion's tears up. They're really pushing me with these deals with the devil. They're really making me think. I was thinking about not even taking it. I wish I had Book of Belial charged, but of course I don't. So that sucks. And Carrie and Queen, she's gonna take forever to beat. So, like I said, I might lose this run. There's a pretty good chance I'll actually lose this run, actually. That didn't work. Uh, I don't work at all. Karen Queen's like, please die. I'll gladly throw some bombs at you just to fucking end this. And this run is definitely not not even close to the definition of OP at all. Headless baby, if you could like keep up with me, maybe we could create some creep. What I just what I hit? I don't even know what I hit. And peep. We might die in here. You now for a Judas run, this wasn't really what I was expecting. No, Judas was holding down, but I just I just don't think the game is really working with this run. If, if I was anybody but Judas, I would have probably been done a long time ago. So I'll give it that. Because my item rooms weren't good. My Days of Devil weren't good. Nothing was really that good in this run at all. You know, if I had some way to regenerate health. I mean, usually by this time in the game, you know, I have cap-like health generally. But I didn't get anything to really give you health at all. Nothing to regenerate spirit hearts. Not, a lot, not any really spirit heart drops. So, I said this run is not looking too hot. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do that because I don't know how to switch my cards. I'm going to use that first. Which will just up my damage. I don't know why I didn't do that earlier, but I'm going to do it now. I do not know where Loki is. There's Blastasis. I'm not sure if it, if it stacks with Horror Babylon, but you know what? I need all the damage I can get, so. Look, he's up here. Uh, I like the, you know, the design of the new bigger rooms and stuff in Rebirth, but I hate how I can't, when I can't see bosses, I cannot see bosses. I hate that shit. Steven and Gemini. We're not even close to being done, guys. So, you guys want to go ahead and just uh, say, forget this, skip ahead, go ahead. I don't blame you because we're not even close. I think I'm going to get a spirit heart from being this Larry Jr., though. I wish I had Dark Bum. Like, Dark Bum would have been so great right now. Never got him either. Dark Bum would have been the best. 
Look at all these red hearts all over the ground. I can't even make any use of them. But you know what? Horror Babylon is just a great damage upgrade. I, I mean, I've been saying, fuck health, let's go damage. So let's go with the ultimate truck and trial of fuck health, let's go damage. The problem is that we're really not going to get any stronger than this. And since I don't have any health, unless I beat the boss on the womb one, get some health and then trade it away for, like, hopefully ceremonial robes. I'll, I'll do that. If I get an extra upgrade and then they say ceremonial robes, I'll, I'll trade it. Because that's more damage. Oh, wait. I forgot I had freaking, uh, uh, Horror Babylon. I mean, not Horror Babylon. Uh, uh, Nun's Habit. So, every time I get hit, I get a charge, so... Alright, so I got a ton of damage stacked up, so can we please, like, get out of this? Can we complete this? You know? I at least want to complete something on this Judas run, because this Judas run is not looking like a victory at all. You know, I'm saying I want to beat Isaac, and I've never fought Isaac. And, uh, god damn it. Monster 2. I'm sitting here dealing with Gish, and this fucker, this fucker right here is like, <laughs> I'm going to jump on you. Like, nigga. I damn it, Monster 2. I don't got time to be dealing with your shit right now. I don't got time to be dealing with neither one of your guys' shit right now, though. I want to take out Monster 2. Please die. Attacking me off screen. Hate that shit. Uh, are we at the horseman yet? Nope. We get to the horseman, I at least have a general idea of what's up. No, this this run is definitely a loss. I'm going to take double the damage. I'm going to be taking double the damage on uh, on the womb. I pretty much got, you know, if I, take, if I don't take any damage here, I literally got two hits and then I'm dead. So, so you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it. If I get through this and I accomplish this in this Judas run, I'm happy. Because we had to do this anyway for this character anyway, so. And here's the fucking bloat. Very, 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 very difficult boss. Nope. I knew you were going to do that. Always stay above the bloat. If you can. Him out. There's the heart. Mask of infamy. Ah, oh, I am not having fun. <laughs> Where's the mask? Where's the mask? And from the side, because I probably can't get behind him. Fuck him up, eat dead bird. Fuck him up. Fuck him up. Cause God, item rooms. No. No. Thoughts. I mean, freaking. Uh, deal with the devil? No, not really. <laughs> no way to regenerate my health. Hello? You're blue famine. Can I get a spirit heart? Damn, there's red hearts galore and I can't do nothing with them. If I had fucking dark bum right now, I would probably be at cap health. To tell you the truth, I'd probably be at cap health. Say, is death still alive? I think it is. I don't know what's going on right now. <laughs> oh, there's war. I said, I don't like this whole off camera shit in a spirit heart. Finally, we're in the final wave. So, you know what? I think this is a victory, and I think. We can go ahead and at least call that I did something this run. I accomplished something on this run. Being boss gauntlet with Judas. This episode is plenty long, too. Where are you? I don't know where you're at, nor do I really want to get close to you. Are we done? There we go, Judas' Shadow. 
Wow, and that's what I get from my freaking uh, doing all of this. Look at all these red hearts. I wish I had dark bum. Look at this. There's red hearts galore all over the floor. Well, I got three. I got one, two. No, I got two hits. Two hits and I'm dead. Two hits and I'm fucking dead. Let's say, do you want to like bounce off the wall? They're kind of closing me in here. Nope, I don't want to do any any unnecessary fighting. This run is not looking like a victory at all. I wish I had some way to regenerate my health. I know I said fuck health, it's all about damage, but... It's true to an extent, it's just, you know, I never got anything to, to really blow the doors off the frickin' room. Oh, but to say, if it was Hero Font, I was gonna cry with happiness. Like, please be Hero Font. Just goddamn magician, like, really? I got a guaranteed deal with the devil. I hate this. I hate this a lot. I'll kill you from afar. Can I kill all these fuckers before they get over to me? And I could simply just walk into this corner over here and kill you. I think the boss room is up here. Sure feels like it. Oh, uh, oh. Ooh, spirit heart. Take one more hit. I said, I don't want to give up. Oh my god, the fucking rock. I didn't see that fucking rock. Well, there goes that spirit heart. I should kill you before you reach me. You know what also have been great? If I ever got the ability to fly in this run. There's a couple of things that could have made this run a lot better. Better deals with devils. Better, better deals like Papa John's. This, one, this video is not sponsored by Popper Johns. I let the creep go away. Skolix. I can't even take a deal with the devil, even if they offered me one. I don't have enough health. Yeah, it's gonna be uh, three spirit hearts. I only got one, two and a half, so I can't even take a freaking deal with the devil, even if I wanted to. There we go, I just need to get a couple shots and damage is good, it's just I can't hit him. Can't hurt Skolix. There we go. There we go. Alright, I got an HP upgrade. Please, ceremonial robes. Please. <sighs> but I'm not that good with Mom's knife. I said I really would like the ability to fly, I'll take the ability to fly. Because I am not that good with Mom's knife, I need to get better with it. And this isn't the run to be trying to fucking fiddle with mom's knife right now. I'd rather just fly and shoot my tears. What is Carson the on? I think I don't know what my item is, but it doesn't really matter. Yeah, whatever item I get is not really that important. I don't get any items, actually. And I think it gets an item outside the boss. Which I'm not planning on to. I mean, unless the game wants to be generous and give me something. But I doubt it. I said I, said I wanted the ability to fly. And they're like, here you go. Here's the ability to fly. Work with it. I'm like, alright. I'll try. The fool. The world. <sighs> oh, I don't know my health. That's what Curse of the Unknown is. Well, I only, only got two more hits, so... No, that's not really helping. What's my other card? I don't even, oh, the fool. Right? The fool. Yeah, I got two of the fool cards in the world. Right? Yeah. I could pop it here. But I really feel like... I, using another cathedral might be beneficial.
But I could easily die on this floor. I already beat Mom's Heart with Judas. Stars, there's no item room here, so thank you for that useless card. <laughs> and now I feel like I'm going around in circles, so... I guess I'll go the other directions. Uh, they didn't give me an obvious one here, so that kind of sucks. Definitely not one where it's just like, oh yeah, it's definitely this direction. Yeah. I like got a couple of different directions that we could go, so... Nope, there it is. So I'm glad I didn't pop the world card. It's right there. Polycephalus is a dick. I hate this fucking boss. A lot. Alright, Mom's heart. Let's do this. Oh, it lives. Same thing. Same diff. Wow, I can't kill that fucking laser eyes in one hit. Okay, I should kill you before you can turn your eyeball at me. As far away as I could possibly be. Oh wow, this is not looking fun. I took damage again? Ugh. Let's go up. I said I was going to go up, didn't I? <sighs> Pop the world card. There's a mini boss up there. I have no idea who it is, but... Go this way. And... Oh. I gotta fight Isaac for the first time that I've ever fought him. In this game, in this game, I fought him in the original game, but not this game where they changed him. I think I made him a little bit easier, actually. Fucking dirty. Junior. Ugh, that almost gave me a heart attack. Fucking greeds. Little greeds. Hate these fuckers. Same room again. <laughs> That's fine. If you want to keep on giving me rooms like this, I don't mind. These rooms are easy. I don't like this, though. Spawn some more flies. Spawn some more flies. Shoot the flies. Shoot the flies. Shoot the flies. If I said, baby, get it. Oh, thank God. Like, please don't let that fucking shit come over me. Do not jump on top of me. Don't do that. Don't be a cunt. Don't be a dick. One's dead. Monstro is easy. And you know what we're definitely gonna do? We're gonna throw some bombs down and blow up these damn fires. Because fires can draw spirit hearts. And that just increases my chances of victory. Every spirit heart's one more hit I could take, so. Wow, alright. I really didn't get it. I should get it, though. So I don't really use bombs offensively anyway, so. One spirit, one, you know what? One spirit heart? That's one more spirit heart than I didn't have, so. Not complaining. Uh, that's fine too. I didn't mean to do that, but still. Let me negate some of the damage that I'll be taking from Isaac. If we win this run, I'd, I'd, I'll be happy. I'll be happy. We'll pop the Magician, pop Book of Belial. Let's go ahead and fight Isaac. Let's end this. Phase two. Oh, I did not know he did that attack. Okay, up, oh, final Isaac. Should be safe in this corner. Then he's gonna do his spiral attack. He's gonna fly up again. Oh, wrong corner. I need to get used to that. I could have stood at the door though. 
I think we might win this. I think we might win this. Stand at the door. Stand directly at the door. Yep, see? It's a tip and trick for you guys. We're fighting Isaac. Stand at the if you stand at the door, it can't hit you. And we won! We actually won this run. Yay! I, 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 it was risky. It was risky. I was like, there's no way I could have went. I'm not generating my health, but what'd I say? Damage over health. My damage was so good that even with low health, I still won. Yeah! Guillotine. I don't know how to feel about that item. Some people hate it, some people like it. It tears up, it damage up, but it literally attaches your head from your body and then makes your head a uh, an orbital. So, you, you know, you're, you're looking at your head and then you take damage because you actually take damage off of your body. It's weird. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and call it episode. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Binding of Isaac Rebirth. That was a good one. I, it was looking dicey. So let's go ahead and look at our friend Judas here. He should be looking fresh. Yeah, he is. He's like, yeah, I beat the boss gauntlet and Isaac. You know, he's the only one to do that. You know, he still hasn't beat the lamb though. So we need to do that on a later day. Anyway, I'm not sure who we're gonna play as. Let's play as OP Azazel and just get his. We're gonna play as Azazel next time. Just get his over with. Like, look, like Azazel is gonna have the most done. We're gonna go with Azazel next time. All right. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And I will see you guys next time with some more Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Thanks for watching.